So what's up guys, just a very quick video where I will try to sell you an add-on as usual to get all your hard-earned cash into my pocket. That's what I love most. Except this add-on is free. Yes, you heard me right, this add-on is free. A very, very cool, simple add-on that is just one button, very straight to the point, that does very nice things. So when you open up Blender or get files from other people, obviously it's set to EV, the samples are enormously high, the noise threshold is bad, um, the open denoiser is like just on the highest settings, but still GPU is disabled, just very bad settings, the motion blur is off, transparency is off, persistent data is off, color management is by default on AGX, even though it should be on standard by default before you set up wrong and weird looking shaders. The statistics are off. Just so many little annoying things. Um, oh, and obviously the render path and PNG sequence, like, ah, why did they do it like this for so many years? So I made a very, very simple add-on. You just hit it once, pop, it's free. The click is free. You can click it as many times as you want for free for all the people without money can use this add-on. It automatically sets a render path. Uh, and when you actually save the file somewhere, so let's save it to the desktop. Then you just save the file in the preferred um, yeah, Blender file name. And when you hit the button once again under tools and go back, it will add the name of the Blender file underscore hashtag, 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 hashtag for the frame number. So yeah, you can just start rendering and it just puts it into a render folder because if you unpack textures, it will also um, put it into the textures folder. So this will put it into the render folder. Yeah, that's basically it. A very, very simple add-on. But yeah, I just often receive Blender files with very bad settings, very bad render settings, and just everything, yeah, annoying. And also when I start new projects, um, yeah, this is just a quick way to set up a basic setting. This is not a high-end setting. Everything is set for very, very fast render speed. So basically set for the, yeah, most value of render quality compared to render time. Um, that's how it's set up. So the denoiser is on optics. When you render a better version of this, you should set it to open denoise and very important to fast and probably to GPU. But yeah, that's not what this add-on is for. This add-on is just for a quick setup. I thought maybe a maybe three buttons like preview rendering, middle and high end, but I thought everyone's gonna set that by their own. But yeah, just to get a default blender running, um, that's it. That's it, free add-on, have fun with it. I use it all the time, maybe you will too. So good luck, have fun, and see you next time with another add-on by Damien Matthew.